When you hear the word sweets, what do you think of? Cookies? Cake? Ice cream? Well, in Japan, it's wagashi or nothing. Wagashi are Japanese sweets made using traditional techniques. Can you think of sweets anywhere in the world that are more beautiful? Two people who love Japanese food are going to give us an in depth report on wagashi. They're visiting a popular wagashi shop in Setagaya, Tokyo. Whoa, there are so many different kinds of wagashi. Yeah, I know, but you know, the most popular, important, the most favorite wagashi of all time is. Wait, I know it. It's Anko. 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 Anko is made by simmering sugar together with azuki beans. The beans are then mashed or pureed into a paste with a mild, sweet flavor. No Anko, no wagashi. Anko is the magical wagashi ingredient that goes with anything. Today, we're going to show you three types of wagashi that showcase Anko's magic. The first sweet is called Monaka. For me, it looks like the macaroon. It does look like yeah. a macaroon. Monaka is made by filling a wafer cake made from rice flour with Anko. Crunchy on the outside, Anko on the inside. Two textures for your eating pleasure. Mm. Mm. So sweet, so yeah. nice. Delicious Anko paste. Oh, yeah. The bean paste is a little bit sweeter, I think, with this yes. one. But it goes really, really well with like the sort of crispy outside. Japanese sweets are just wonderful. They're two completely opposite textures that form a perfect combination. You could say it's like Holmes and Watson, the perfect partnership. Elementary, my dear Watson. Anko is the best! Right? Yes! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Next up, it's dorayaki. We've got like more anko inside there, right? Yeah. It's so soft. Yeah. <laughs> dorayaki batter is made by mixing eggs, sugar, and flour together. This batter is then grilled like small pancakes. These are put together with anko to make a sweet sandwich. The mild sweetness of the batter matches delightfully with Yanko. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh, wow. oh my god, it tastes so good. I think this is one of my favorite wagashi. Oh man. Like the azuki beans aren't that sweet. It kind of like yeah. it goes really well with like the uh, the pancake layers. Oh man, I, I could I could eat so many of these. Two sweets coming together as one. Verily, tis like the romance of Romeo and Juliet. Anko really is the best, right? Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Next, we have Daifuku. It's really like soft and like chewy as, as, as <laughs> much as should be. Anko is wrapped in mochi or rice cake. Mochi is made by pounding steamed glutinous rice into a cake. The deal is sealed by adding salty boiled beans. The salty beans and mochi are the perfect vehicle to highlight the sweet flavor of the Anko. I love this very, you know, soft, sticky rice cake. Oh! Oh my god! Like you bite through like the soft, kind of mochi outside. Yeah. And get to like the really sweet bean paste in the middle. It works really well together. Yeah, I it agree is. Mmm. Two different ingredients coming together as one is like me and you. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Be sure to experience wagashi on your trip to Tokyo.